Okay, I'm now going to do um, a video showing you how to build the bushing. Okay, let's uh, scroll down to that. The bushing is a really simple part. It's really just um, a few circles that are extruded is how I would build it. You could build this L shape and revolve it around the center axle, but I think that's uh, harder. So I'm going to just draw this big circle, draw a smaller circle, draw the even smaller circle, and extrude it back in. Other way you could do it is you could build like a donut shape in your sketch of the big circle with the small circle, extrude that, and then push this on top of it. Yeah, it really doesn't matter how you build it as long as you end up with the right result. Okay, so we're gonna go to Fusion. We have a new sketch ready to go, or a new uh, a file ready to go. I'm gonna do a new sketch. Okay, we need a circle. I don't remember how big it is now. This one is a diameter of 1.375. Okay, diameter, 1.375, enter. Okay, so that's a good start. Then it needs to be extruded this bit. Um, you could extrude it all the way up and then extrude that down, or you can subtract this from that and you'll end up with that thickness. That's what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna say 0.75, which is the overall, minus 0.5, which is a quarter inch. So I have to extrude it one quarter inch. Finish sketch, extrude tool, 0.25, enter, and we have the start of a, of a bushing. Okay. Um, next thing you know is we need another circle centered with a one inch diameter. Okay, so I'm gonna click on here, create a sketch, Circle tool, finds the middle, one, enter. Okay, and that looks correct. And that is gonna get extruded half an inch. Okay. Extrude, pick the right one. Remember, we don't want that one, we want this one. 0.5, enter. Okay, only thing we have left now is to make a hole in the middle. Um, this hole is a three-quarter inch diameter hole, and we're going to do a cut extrude all the way through. Okay, so uh, again, you could pick either side, the bottom or the top. Pick the top because it's already there. And I'm going to double check what measurement I need. Three-quarter inch diameter. Circle tool. I can go 0.75 or I can go 3 quarters. Okay, enter. And then we're going to cut extrude that down. And the, the distance that we need to go is this 0.75 total. Okay. So I'm going to go uh, extrude this. And I'm going to go not up. I'm going to go negative 0.75. If you notice when I go negative, it automatically turns it into a cut. And that's it. And if I just grab a corner and I kind of move, it should see the, all the way through. Okay, and there's my very simple bushing. Last thing to do is to go save bushing. If I look over here, I already have a bushing in this folder, so I'm going to call it bushing2 and save it. And then I know it's saved because it says bushing2 up there. I can see it populating in my data panel. One more part to go, which is the wheel. Okay. Um, look for that video.